Do our thoughts and words have power? Well, I've seen a lot of videos on YouTube and all over the place where people put some rice in a jar <clears throat> and they write words on it and every day they say either you idiot or thank you to the rice in a jar and it grows mold or it doesn't or it turns into sweet, whatever. So I decided to do the experiment myself. So just over a month ago, uh, I boiled three jars. Every day I remembered I would pick up each jar this one I would pick up and I would just say thank you and I would feel feelings of happiness and positivity and as you can see the water has not been absorbed by it um, it looks pretty clean um, the rice itself the water it all looks very clean there's no discoloration it just looks like rice in water um, perfectly sterile so you can see I wrote thank you on that one so there hasn't been any change in the thank you jar. And the same is true of the control jar. So the control jar looks pretty much exactly like the thank you jar. Uh, nothing has really changed. The water's a little bit more brown, but, and there's a little bit of scum. You can see a little bit of scum on the edge of, see it there, rising up on the edge of the, of the jar itself. But other than that, there's, I don't really see much difference between the control and the thank you, but there is no real scum along the line of the thank you jar. Now, the third jar, you idiot. Every day I remembered I would pick up this jar and say to it, you idiot. Um, there is not only discoloration, uh, but there's also brown and blue mold growing inside of this jar. And also the rice, as you can see, has soaked up the water. There's not really a lot of water left flowing around. There's a lot of scum on the sides of the jar, as you can see. Um, but that mold is undeniable. And these jars have not been opened. Uh, I taped the tops and gave my housemates instructions not to open it. And it doesn't look like it's been opened because we don't even own this tape. I borrowed it from a friend, so they couldn't have retaped it. So at the very least, the thank you jar and the you idiot jar are both the exact same jars from the exact same product from the exact same company. So um, the difference is not related to anything to do with the jar and they were both boiled in the same water. They were filled with the same rice from the same pan and the same uh, water that was also boiled was added to the rice. So the only difference between these two jars, I also tried to put them on the same table out in the sunlight. So the only difference between these two jars is the fact that one was called an idiot and one was uh, thanked every day. So what do these results mean? Well, that's for you to decide.